Well, hey there, everybody. Jay Barino here. It's Insurrection Remastered. We're heading into map number 11. This is the last Terran mission. It's my personal opinion that this is one of the worst maps of the entire campaign. We'll see what Vorgas has done to change it. The layout of the map is just atrocious. Luckily, we don't have to destroy every building, only the production buildings. That'll make a big difference. But uh, late game Terran v Terran is uh, one of the most arduous matchups, in my opinion. And this is, it's huge. It's just a huge map. Here we go. We cleaned out those Zerg, but I still can't help feeling we're missing some of the pieces. It was just too convenient how we found you. You think there's an inside man. Carpenter's influence runs deep. It's entirely possible. So, what do we do? We strike at the heart. I don't follow. We go after Carpenter. Now's the time he won't be expecting it. Of course he won't be expecting it. It would be suicide. We took the council. If we strike fast and hard, they'll never know what hit them. The longer we wait, the more powerful they grow. Meanwhile, we're being chipped away by the hammer. I'm in. You're both nuts. All right, I'll do it. I won't like it, but I'll do it. <laughs> That's got to be one of the more classic lines. You're both nuts. All right, I'll do it. <laughs> no pause. No thought process, just, I don't like this. All right, I'll do it. <laughs> Destroy the Fist of Redemption. Eliminate all Zerg in the area. Heroes must survive. I believe that there was uh, an objective to kill Tsunami as well. I'm not sure why that's not there. Okay, let's get going. This is an odd map. It's, again, also huge. These are all missile turrets that you see. It's nice of Orgas to have revealed this for us. He's also revealed the bridge. I think this is the only way to get over here, which is important. So we got to pretty much just eliminate all of this, and then there's a little outpost down here we got to figure out how to get down and, and destroy as well so for now let's just focus on building up uh let's hotkey my heroes we have four new dressed and elite guards i think what i'm going to try to do is take some extra bases early with the intention of getting all of my upgrades out super quick i think that's going to be the right choice probably get a couple medics out for jack frost and then we can use my heroes perhaps to to move out and start scouting a little bit Okay, well, we do have an engineering bay. That's nice. So what I can do is at least start setting up some missile turrets along the, the ledge here. There's no ground path anywhere, I recall. It's, it's just, like, along this ledge. What we could do, though, is use Black Morgan to look because this is going to be probably a little different than the original. It depends, again, on what Vorgaz has changed. I, I found this to be notoriously one of the worst maps here. So let's take uh, Charlie and his little group of buddies to fly around and see what we can find. Jack Frost, just stand in the front because you're super strong. So my goal is just to get out some basic production structures in order to get probably four armories, two engineering bays, and let's go and look for bases. What's that supposed to mean, buddy? What's that supposed to mean, buddy? I guess that's it, then. You guys that's are nuts. All right, I'll do it. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so yeah, this is all... This is all just a ledge, so what I'll probably do is set up turrets all through here. Two can play at this game of making an absurd amount of anti-air. recognize those uniforms anywhere. It's the hammer. You can't mean... They've been conspiring with the rebels the entire time. Give me Tsunami's head. It's payback time. <laughs> it's payback time. Some things never change. Destroy the hammer, Tsunami must like die. Okay, so there it is. I don't remember if that yes, one popped up right away or not. Frost. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> I think that's a line. I'm pretty sure that that right there is a line that was added. I, I, I remember it was talked about how that was in the voice files, but it was never used. It was supposed to be said when he gets killed in the original. Because in the original, he's just there, and it's kind of hard to realize that he's even there. And then you kill him, and then it's like, oh, he's, he's just gone now. Um, so that's been definitely changed. Let's keep making these turrets up along the ledge. Uh, I found a base up here. That's pretty nice. So let's grab an SCV and go and take that right away. And then I see a huge amount of minerals up here. So let's, uh, again, grab Charlie and his group of wraiths and fly up here and see what we can find. There's, like, random parts of the map that are that are revealed. It's like little bits of this temple. It's very strange to me. I'm not sure what that's about. Anyway, let's go and see if we can find more one or more bases. What? Eats the fallen? It's not Devour's children. 
Those sound like risky odds. Again, a lot of this stuff I know I'd seen Vorgoth's talking about, but I, now I'm seeing it in action. There were just random. There were units in the editor that that were there called "Devours the Fallen" or "Eats the Fallen," but no indication on what they were in there for. Uh, I guess now we're getting a bit of a taste on what the the whole point was here. Oh, I made a second factory. Did not mean to do that. That was supposed to be a starport. Uh, okay, so let's start getting basic upgrades. Go ahead and start building this. I think I just, I, I think it's going to be important that we just make a lot of missile turrets everywhere. Just to ensure that we don't get killed by, like, the errant wraith attack, because that would be really frustrating. So let's come on down here and just start making turrets way down here. Siege check for sure. And Caduceus reactor. Okay, now we're short on minerals. That's okay, so... Ready to rock I guess what I'm gonna do roll. is fly around to these entrances Those and kill these like because they're they're devouring ones. They they might be a little better than devouring ones actually, but just to ensure that nothing really bad happens to us. Let's try to keep these heroes alive for as long as possible. Oh god, oh god. Well, there go all those wraiths. Uh you I'd be honored to Okay, well this kind of confirms that the uh Bane, ready to rock the Zerg roll. and the Fist of Redemption are working together, which it's means by extension the hammer is working with them as well. You I'd so, be honored to kill. Charlie, you can I trust that you can kill a Goliath. I think that's all of those that we killed. I think we got them all. Okay, let's just keep making turrets down the side. And up the side. I think this is I think this is worth it. This might be a big waste of my time. It's kind of hard to say. Okay, Caduceus Reactor. This is being built. And then what I'm gonna do is start rallying SCVs up here. Not enough minerals. Hello? Anybody home? Okay, Charlie, why don't you scout this out for us? And see if we can come up here and take this base, because this is super rich in minerals. Yes, sir. Temple Guardian. This is it's so weird. <laughs> Okay, Charlie can't Don't handle that himself. Like That's odd. so odd. I guess we just want to run up there with Jack and some extra units to take care of that. Um, yeah, it's just extra strange what this is. So I think th the idea with this map is we really need to just... We have to try really hard... Oh, okay. Uh, we have to try really hard to make sure that we don't carelessly lose bases like this. We need to set up defense as we go, but then on top of that, it's important that we, we make new production structures as we get to new areas of the map. All right. Get in there, Jack. I know that you can handle this. Okay, just keep making more of these. So I think what we're going to want to do is get some units up to blockade the white base by setting stuff up over here. Okay, that thing followed me the entire way across the map. That means it's just one less thing that we have to worry about. That's that's good. Let's just keep making stuff down here to ensure we don't get hit. I hear... I heard... Okay, I guess... I think we stopped him from doing something. That's actually really important. Okay, when you're done there, why don't you repair this guy? Okay, re repair this, not repair this, build a refinery, and then let's just make a couple turrets back here as well. Just the occasional turret really never hurt anybody. We know we can afford them. Actually, we can't, that's, that's ironic that at that exact moment we get the not enough minerals. Okay, so let's do this. All right. These guys, your game. I don't know if... I, I would assume if we if we bring the new dressed and elite guards <clears throat> as well, we can clear out the upper right. I just want to ensure that we don't carelessly lose this base over here. So let's set up a, a bunker here as well. Get one more turret in the back there. Keep making SCVs. Let's get a commsat station. Okay, and again, I really want to just start slamming out upgrades, like, very quickly, but we're not quite in the situation to do that yet. It's just expensive. I need to take that upper right base, but we know that there's Heroic Zerg there. I think with my heroes I could do it, but I don't really want to quite risk it yet. That's the problem. So you guys load on in. All right. You guys come home. And then once we take that upper right base, we have to defend it as well. So we're not quite... We're not quite in the situation to do it. Let's grab another tank. We have Caduceus Reactor. Let's grab Restore. I'm realizing this map, it's TVT. There's going to be a lot of lockdown. So without medics, this map would honestly be a huge pain. So it's probably good that we're playing with Brood War Tech, because otherwise, again, without Restore. Ugh. Okay, looks good. 
this is this is pretty heavily saturated now. Let's go ahead and saturate. I, I know it's wacky for me to saturate this gas, but I mean, whatever. It's fine. Hotkey this. I'd like to take the upper right. It may seem like I'm in a rush, and that's only because this map takes forever if you're not quick. Something. So let's grab this group and make our way well, over here, I suppose, to ensure that this doesn't go down. Jack Frost! Charlie Vane, save us! Okay, it all worked out. Yes, okay, see, they, they actually are trying to sneak some units over here, so I'm making all these turrets. Two can play at the game of a bizarre, a bizarrely long defensive missile turret line. Ha ha. Okay, so... We take we this group. You could use a little help. We move up no here. Problem. This group keeps attacking us. No big deal. Um, yeah, sure. Make that there so that it looks nice. And then two more turrets probably along this turret line, and we're in good shape. There we go. Cool. So our missile line, our missile turret line is done, I think, for the most part. We might want to make a couple that just hang out back here just in case. I don't know how they'd get through to this area, but I just I don't want to risk it. So let's just set up a couple over here. Your forces are under attack. Let's show them we mean business. Okay, I prefer not to lose. Okay, there's more of these things. I think those are just normal. I'd like to try to clear this out, and then we'll send some SCVs up. We don't need many. This should be enough. Okay, be careful, Jack Frost. Stim. Once again, Jack Frost showing us the way, the light, the truth. Okay, perfect. So let's hang out here. We've got those SCVs coming up here. we got to set up a defensive line in this area to ensure that this doesn't go down next. Okay. The enemy's 1-1. We don't actually have those kind of upgrades. The hammer is coming in on us. That's a pretty big attack. Okay, that could have been worse. Uh, repair, 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 repair. I assume those all took some splash damage. Okay, so the next thing we need are command centers. I'm gonna offset them a little bit. The name's Vane. I, I, I thought I set up more SCVs, but I guess not. So you come on up here. That's a weirdly placed geyser. I guess if we make our command center like here, we can collect from it. Some things never Did change. Page me? Yes. Okay, sir. and then I'll grab a few more SCVs to send up there so that we can repair and then build turrets and bunkers and production structures. This is gonna be my staging point, because there's a lot of room up here too. We can set up a lot of uh, a lot of stuff. Okay, looking good. And the enemy has the enemy is really mobilized here, so my next step is to grab Multiple upgrade structures, so we're gonna grab four armories. So let's get started. I built that extra factory. I may just float it all the way up. Okay, cram this in. There we go. Perfect. Okay, you all get mining. This is being built. Perfect. It's weird with those Zerg. I don't. I still don't really understand what that was about. Can my new dressed and elite guards regenerate health? I didn't think so. It doesn't look like it. Okay, so we're going to start making barracks in this vicinity. What? Oh my god! Um. Can we please, can we please kill this thing? I'm sending my heroes in. This might be a big mistake. He's distracted by the command center. Just keep an eye on Charlie Vane, or Jack Frost, rather. He's okay, okay. The name's Vane. Um, so the question is, is he just gonna keep respawning? It was a Tarask, and he did his little tortured roar thing, which is a little scary. What I was saying is I'm gonna lift this off and float it all the way up here. Then I could land it in this vicinity. Base is under attack. Aha! I was ready. I was ready for this. Wasn't sure whether to expect this or not. I would love it if my SCVs didn't get path blocked to repair that. That would have been nice, wouldn't it have? Draw him into the other one. Okay, these are all done. You all get back to mining, weapon ship, 
ship plating, vehicle plating. Wow, I remembered what those all were. I'm actually pretty impressed with myself. Nukes could be a pretty good option here. As I mean, and then obviously some battle cruisers. If I recall, the bottom left where the Zerg are isn't even accessible via ground, so I might just ignore that. I'm going to leave my heroes here until I'm pretty certain that there will or will not be another Tor a, a, a Torask that comes through here. Okay, grab this. This guy's floating his way over here, so let's land him somewhere. And then we're going to get this base all saturated, so... Um, Hello? Anybody home? Intriguing start. I, I still don't fully understand why a Torask spawns again. I feel like that's, uh, that's just something that uh, Vorgaz has put in specifically. I guess we're going to need more turrets up here. I'm not sure where those mutalisks came from. That was strange. Okay. Covert ops, physics lab. Get back to mining. You. Black Morgan, you can stay down here forever. Honestly, it doesn't matter. Uh, I don't think I've really built any other units since my starting units. And I haven't had to because they're extremely strong. We're going to put nuke silos over up on, on this area. Okay, and I'm thinking we... Turn all these into barracks. And by t turn all these into barracks, what is going on? Again, I'm I'm focused on actually... I'm not really making many much uh, engaging commentary here, only because I'm I'm actually focusing on what to do to finish this quickly. Because otherwise, this is this is a long and tedious map, and it's already taken quite a bit of time. So I'm trying to to get going here. You know, actually, no, you guys stay back here because we don't know what's going to happen. Set up turrets up here. Can we fit SCVs back here. Set up turrets back here. I wonder if we can even fit back there. It looks like no, that's fine. Just get a turret like right there just in case. Yes, you can. Build it. Okay, there we go. Long-term gas is going to be a thing, but for right now, I think we're safe. Okay, and then keep making supply depots. This is about all about long-term setup, if that's not clear. We're trying to just get as many upgrades as possible early on so that we don't have to worry about this later. EMP shockwave, Apollo reactor, Charon boosters... Marines, why don't you make your way up here if you can? So we're going to continue getting... Get out of here! We're going to keep getting attacked over here until we're able to move out and stop them from getting to us from this direction. That's the important thing. So that's why I really want to try to move soon. I'm realizing now, is this... Can I even... Okay, it's a dead end. I was a little afraid that that was not a dead end. Weapons, ship... Ship plating. Ship. There we go. Okay. I, I do remember the hotkeys. I'm actually pretty proud of myself. Not sure what this tank is doing. He's like right on top of us. Okay. Come on over here. Repair, repair. I'd like to try to get into a position where we're cutting the hammer off entirely, as I had mentioned. All right. You lift off. You're in a weird spot. So let's try to get you somewhere where you won't block units as they spawn. So like right there. It, to me, seems like that Torask is not coming back, but I can't really be sure. Let's start getting starports back here. We're going to set up at least two factories, maybe three. Again, this is all about how fast we can get units out. So that's why I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to basically be overbuilding this. Where did I have this land? Okay, let's put the next one right there. And that's probably good. We can even get another barracks if we so choose, but I don't really choose. Let's let's get a lot of starports instead. Right there. Right there. Lots and lots of upgrades completing. Okay, Mobius reactor, Yamato gun, irradiate. Is there anything left here? Optical flare. I'm glad I still have this uh, this bunker loaded up. It's worth it. Bounce attack's gonna hurt us. I re I mean, this is why I just set up turrets everywhere. I did I had no idea where the enemy would come from or how they would attack us. Is there anything up here? I, I think I see something on the. No, there's nothing back here. All right, I'm pretty confident now that the Torask is not coming back. It doesn't seem like it, at least. That's not gonna be able to land. Oh, maybe it will. Nope. Okay, right there. I could even get another one. I'm going to get one more uh, starport instead. You all get back to mining. 
We only have 17 supply. It's about that time, I'd say. Control tower. Control tower. Control tower. Okay, and now it's time where we start slamming out units. Your forces are under attack. Uh, <laughs> panic mode, let's go, get down here. I, I have to stop these units from getting to me. I can't tell if they're being dropped or what. Oh my god. Well, we've been prepared. This is working. Start making marines. We're gonna even make fire bats. We're gonna make ghosts. We're gonna make medics and marines. I just moved my units out of here. Some things never change. Charlie Vane being the hero that we need right now. I'd like to keep this base alive for as long as possible. These units are so slow it doesn't even matter. Just bring them back. Okay. Charlie Vane, come up here. This map is just so big. This is extremely irritating if you can't tell. This is a very, very uh, annoying and huge map. Only because it, it's, like, impossible to react in any particular direction, so it's, it's something. So we're going to spend 8 million years repairing everything up after this. Uh, okay, nuke silo. Sure, get get spider mines and stuff. Hello? Anybody home? They, they moved in and destroyed my missile turrets, so I guess it was good that I built those because they distracted the enemy. Okay, heroes, you're going to stay here. Downtown. Yes, sir. Okay, and then the next key is going to be pushing up into that other area in order to... You want a piece of me going for an exterminator? So I see just to the left of me, and I know that Charlie ran into it this area. We got to clear up this upper area, and then we can move towards the bridge. If we cut them off at the bridge, they theoretically can't get to us. That's my goal. That's what we need. And then we need to also get plus three everything, which we can afford now, so at least we're starting it. Plus three, plus three. Get personal cloaking. I'll probably get locked down as well. And I think that's pretty much every upgrade that's been queued up, which is something. We're already back up into reasonable supply amounts. And then let's just keep making supply depots. Some things never change. So let's stock our nuke silos, and I could get even another one. We don't have much room for it, but I think I could I could stick a, a command center here and get another nuke silo. So let's do that. Your forces are under attack. Okay. And the important the thing here is that our uh, we have some units that are cutting off the enemy from getting Your close to us. My God. Yeah. See, they're they're moving past me and attacking this base down here constantly. Hello? It's really, really annoying. We have to get up there and do some damage, otherwise this is just gonna keep happening. So just keep making Marines, fire bats. I wanna nuke that area too. So we're gonna make Goliaths and uh, just a basic force. And then we've got some battle cruisers coming out as well. Okay, well, if we can save this base, then we're gonna be, then we're going because I, I can't stand this anymore. It's constant. Okay, these two, these guys can cloak. I thought I sent Charlie down, but he's too slow. Lifting it off, just gonna make it worse. Okay, well. There we go, the nukes are ready. And now we're supply blocks. Okay, well, again, this was all about the setup. I took a big risk by not really building anything up until now. And it, it it's mostly paid off. We just keep we keep losing individual things because of the stupid attack waves that come in through this direction. So the key is to cut those off. I'll go and rebuild that base, I don't care. But as you can see, the, the, the amount of time we've taken to make virtually no progress on this map is pretty astronomical and very annoying, so let's... Wait, see, like, where did these come from? They must be dropping on me. I don't know if they're just walking by us or what, but this is why the map is so big. There's three enemy factions, they all do different things. It's just so annoying. I didn't hotkey my... Yes, I did. It's just because it got destroyed. So we want to scan here. We want to nuke here. And when this nuke lands, we're going to move. Okay, so you all move back up here. This is being rebuilt. This is landing. I can't even see it, but I'm sure it's, it's going to work. Battlecruisers start moving. 
We're gonna move in with everything. What I don't have are science vessels, I realize. That's a problem. Okay. Give me a nuke silo. Anywhere. Right there is fine. Tank Jack Frost and Charlie Vane, actually. We're going to bring all this stuff. Let's go. Decloak. I grab Lockdown. Okay, and then New Dresden Elite Guard are kind of leading the charge here. It's another base we can take up in this direction. I hear Spider Mines. Char uh, actually, Jack Frost is in extreme danger because of that. Plus three is finishing. Again, I do feel that it's extreme. This is this is what we have to do. We have to get rid of this. What was that, Siren? Interesting. Something Charlie Van, you can take change. this out yourself. Okay, we seem safe from that. Okay, this is done. Remake our comset station. And then we just have to make more depots. Okay, that should be expected. This should be expected, but I... I don't know why I wasn't ready for this. So many lockdowns. Okay, so we need science vessels. Science vessels, like three of them, and then make more battle cruisers. That's fine. Okay. And I want to get down to that bridge. I have to get down to the bridge. And then I gotta get the science vessels. Okay, so you all... We're gonna attack right here. It's very clear that this is where they're all coming from. So if we can... Just get units down to this area. Including our heroes. Hello? Anybody home? We'll repair our new Dresden Elite Guards. All of you, make your way on down. We're gonna start nuking our way across that bridge. And now I think we're on a roll. I could have just done mass battle cruiser from the beginning. So if th this is gonna take a while, I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. I should, I should just, I should just do this. I should take the easy way out. I really should, and just make the mass battle cruisers. But again, it's almost, it's like extra boring to play if you do that. I swear to God. Okay. I heard my yes. science vessel spawn. Receiving you all hang out counters. down here. And then we're going to start nuking like crazy. So, oh, heroes, why don't you come on over here? We're going to grab some SCVs. We can resaturate this. See, ah, I see him running by me. I see him. How, how did these get through here? We got to pick this stuff off. Because I don't want it getting close to my production structures. Okay, cool. But again, the only other way they can get to me is is across this bridge. So what we can do is start nuking my way across this bridge, like right there. Whew. Now I don't think money's ever really gonna be a problem on this map. It's just about a, you have we have to keep a consistent push going. That's that's the hardest thing. It's just like a really long and arduous push map. We got to leapfrog our defenses for the most part. Now we just inch up and do it again. Do we need to? I don't think so. Just nuke right there. Somehow we're not in range. Okay, I don't even know which way to go from here. Again, I think the battle cruisers are going to be important, and then we just rebuild them. Lots of rates. You know, again, I don't regret building this. It's like a really cheeky attack that's coming from the bottom right. Good work, StarCraft 1 AI, for being extremely duplicitous. Okay. And let's not waste the supply. Get all this stuff up here. Uh, keep building supply depots so we can get up to 200. I'm not happy about the amount of... I'm not happy with the amount of... Uh, your forces are under attack. Fire bats, fire bats, fire. I'm not. It's. I am happy with the amount of fire bats, but I'm not happy with the uh, amount of uh, bases we've already lost. Okay. Looks good. 
And I, sh I should probably just set some stuff up down there. So I think I've gotten every single possible upgrade for Terran at this point. I think I think so. Yeah, now I have lockdown as well. Getting a lot of ghosts. Okay, let's move up. Okay, the next goal is to start pushing down and getting rid of a bunch of these, uh... Well, here's what we're gonna do. This is gonna be really satisfying, I think, if we can pull this off. We're gonna cloak, we're gonna nuke all these units down here. Like, right there. They're not gonna know what to do with themselves. Actually, nope, now they're starting to cross the bridge. If, if this lands, it's gonna be great, and I think it will. Please. 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 Yes. Yes! Ha-ha! Okay, two can play at this game, AI, and then we're gonna start getting rid of a bunch of these missile turrets, because there's a million of them and they're super annoying. Okay, as long as the missile turrets kinda, or the, uh, the science vessels stay close to us. Okay, and then, this is all unbuildable terrain except right there, that's weird. Uh, all of you just attack over here. I do have to get rid of a lot of these missile turrets because that's where I'm going to be rallying a lot of my troops. Decloak, we're going to rebuild our nukes. And we have to find where the majority of the uh, the enemy attack waves are coming from. There's another bridge right here, so we're probably going to have to nuke across that as well. Okay, meanwhile, let's rally. Let's just rally over here. Gonna have to constantly be changing these rally points. Infantry being rallied up is gonna be our main jam. Probably Goliaths as well. Honestly, inching with tanks just seems like it would be too time consuming, so probably not even gonna do that. Again, this is a little arduous. We just take a, a ground troop and we just clear out these turrets along the side. It's gonna be worthwhile, I'd say. Finally. Good day, Commander. Okay, I'm gonna wait for another nuke. Uh, what I've been meaning to do is get some SCVs up there to repair and build turrets along the way and build more uh, production structures. So let's grab all these. So let's get these guys all down here. I'm trying to push with my heroes, but honestly, it's it's a little dangerous, as you can imagine. Okay, lots and lots and lots of stuff down there. We have a nuke, right? Okay. So cloak here, we're gonna nuke across this bridge. I don't even know what's over here, but we're gonna nuke it. Looks like it's the right choice. Definitely. Okay, and keep, I mean, our fire bats we know are very strong, so that's why I'm, I'm making a lot of them. Just keep making marines. We're going to need more medics, ghosts, and fire bats. Fire bats are good, so I really don't mind making a bunch of them. The nuke landed. Just nuke again right there. Okay. The nuclear launch detective was mine. Okay. Repair, 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 and repair. I think I think we're good. I think we're good. Yeah, this is this is okay now. We've stopped the enemy from really attacking us or getting close to us. So we want to start attacking up top and clear the top area. So let's just auto attack towards what we see is revealed at this point. Science vessels just follow my battle cruisers for now. And I, I, I don't really know what's over here, and I'm not even going to scan, because I'm probably going to need the scan for other things, so we're just going to go. Okay, where's Jack Frost? Okay, he's here. Heroes, why don't you move up at least? I know you can help us, but it's just too dangerous to allow you to do too much at this point. Okay, I guess you guys get rid of this stuff. There's a random command center on the high ground up here. I probably made some smarmy comment about that the first time I played this in the past. Uh, so I'll do it again. It's really stupid that that's up there. But it's nice that Vorgaz revealed that for us. Okay, is there even anything up here? Like, is it worth us clearing all of this out? Because this looks empty. 
and forces are under attack. Yeah, I, I don't think we want to. I don't think we need to bother with this whole area up here if there's nothing up here. Okay, heroes are alive. Your forces are under attack. We had a medic down here, so it looks like we have to move, push down in this direction. Then there's this over here, which I think we'll use our battle cruisers to destroy. We still need more supply depots at this point. So keep making those, and then we've got a. We just have. We have a lot of stuff that's coming in and rallying. It's just a hassle. Hello? Anybody home? Go ahead, okay, so all of you, why don't you push? I don't know down here. Though wherever the I don't know where the ground path is, but we have to find it. There's so many ghosts. I don't know what I expected. A lot of this stuff's gonna be locked down for a while. This is why it's like you're discouraged from making ghosts for this, not ghosts, uh, battle cruisers for this reason, but it's so annoying to push across this map with anything except. except air units. Okay, we're gonna push down here. We got hammer forces coming in over here. Battle cruisers doing their thing. Okay, this is gonna get nuked, I think. It's a lot of tanks. I don't know, again, I don't know what I expected. Okay, let's refill our nuke silos as well. We're gonna keep pushing with nukes. I've been recording for a while, I, I can tell you that. We're, we're probably at like 45 minutes now, which is too long for only being this far into the map. I mean, like, are you fucking kidding me? Okay. I don't even know how these units got here. It lo I think they went around, like down and around, which is pretty neat. Okay, so we're gonna move in with these SCVs. We're gonna set up more production structures. Ready to rock Heroes, why don't you come in, in here and then start helping us out here? Please attack him. Thank you. Okay. Jesus. Things downtown. It's like taking candy for Our battle cruisers, thankfully, are actually still alive. I, th I, th I figured a lot of them would have been destroyed by this point. Okay, next thing to do, we're gonna make marines, we're gonna make medics, we're gonna make ghosts, we're gonna make fire bats. We're just gonna, I'm just loading up on a little bit of everything. And the reason that I'm doing that is because, as you could tell, like, one strategy is not going to work. Nukes are, are ready. Let's show them how we do things downtown. Okay, Goliath, go to your death. Got a group of stuff here. Okay, and now we just have to wait for more units to make their way down here so that we can push again. This group of tanks is annoying. Uh, Charlie Vane. Anybody home? You? I'd be honored to kill. Why don't we just use it's you to get rid of some of the stuff? One. Meanwhile, my my battle cruisers are gutting them. They're completely. They're my battle cruisers are are just completely gutting them. So this is working. I need to save because anything could go disastrously wrong at this Vane's point. That's for sure. Rock and roll. Those sound like risky odds. Okay, we've just been whittled away. These battle cruisers have been whittled away. Uh, yeah, no, no Yamato, unfortunately. Now we are rallying up. It seems like yeah, this area is their main base. There we go. That's their. That's one of their main barracks areas. Okay, looks good. Charlie Vane being a true hero, pushing, being the vanguard of the enemy's destruction. Hello, anybody home? Okay, we got lots of stuff rallying up. We just got to get them down here. Fist has more stuff down here. It looks like it's like a whole nother base. Yeah, we got to push now. We got to push across in this direction. The name's Vane. Okay. Is there anything else here that we need to be particularly wary of? I think now we just push in with our heroes who can help us clean up for the most part. We have a lot more infantry on their way in. This poor new dressing guard, he wants to get in here and help. These battle cruisers are done, but that's fine. We have more. And then, again, I'm just rallying up like crazy. 
Battle cruisers would slowly get whittled away, don't get me wrong, so it's not like they would be much better. I feel like the- it's not like this map has been particularly changed so far, it seems the same. We gotta get to this base down here, I see mines. There's a hammer base here. Okay, well, we'll keep scouting that. Can we cloak and just nuke across this bridge? I don't even know what's over here, let's just nuke it. Right there. Could be nothing. Nuclear launch detected. Healing frequencies. Okay, and we can at least try, I guess, to repair these. Ooh, we changed targets at the last second. That was lucky. Okay, battle cruisers, make your way on down. All of you attack here and then down here. Get out of here, please. Let's make a couple turrets in this area. Okay, let's move on in and see if we can nuke the next the next area, like right there. Again, nukes clear out enemy bases pretty quick. That's the only reason I'm doing this. Otherwise, this is completely worthless. So let's wait for this to land. We'll just launch another one. Very nice. Why don't we just nuke right there? Now, I, this is this might be where I want to land another. This might be where I want to set up another set of production structures. Though I don't even know if I can get. I don't even know if I can get anywhere else on the map via ground. We still we still have yet to tell if we if we have to if we're gonna have to drop or if we're just gonna have to make mass battle cruiser. I don't know. Okay, that was decently effective. Enough of this. Please go and finish off the fist. We could bring our heroes too. Again, I'm wary of spider mines, but I guess let's just go and see what happens and we'll save. I don't want to split this, but I do kind of want to split this because this is really irritating. And I do release two of these videos a week. There's a lot of work to be done on this map, and I, I, I don't really know what better way to approach this. It's a very, very... It's just long and arduous. It's not even, like, super challenging. The only challenge is probably making sure our heroes don't get sniped. That's that's probably it. Okay, let's make a... Let's actually make a command center here. We're not necessarily going to harvest anything from this area, but it's mostly for uh, being a, a proxy setup. Jack Frost in the front, getting rid of Tarask. Oh, it's just an ultralist, but that's fine. Uh, I hear spider mines everywhere. That's fun for me. Ready to Probably want to get even more production structures. Yeah, I think I am going to set up production structures here. Is this the best place for it, or maybe it's even further in? It depends on if we can get to the hammer base via ground. And again, I don't think we could in the past. I think you might be able to get to the Zerg base. Let's see about restoring these. Not enough energy. So one of these is stuck. I don't have any other medics. That's fine. So, all right. Heroes, you're doing your best. So that should do it for the fist. I'm not thrilled with the fact that there are defilers that keep plaguing us. There we go. They're dead. I heard like three of them die. The Zerg to be seem to be in full swing at this point. Okay, so. If we want, we want to come down here and start setting up a lot of defensive, not defensive buildings, but uh, production buildings. Battle cruisers doing their thing. Make more of them, because I feel like by the end of this, ba mass battle cruisers is the way to go. See, I could have just gone straight for mass battle cruisers, would have had them way earlier, and then would have been in good shape. Um, let's see. Yeah, so it's been... It's been about 45 minutes. Can I finish this in a reasonable amount of time moving forward? I think I think we can. I mean, this hasn't been horrible. It's just it's really long. It's just too long. Okay. Yeah, we got SCVs coming out. I want to bring a few down here to repair my new Dresden Elite Guards who are still alive. Why does a mining colony have elite guards? I don't know. I guess the time is now for the... Like, the need is great. All right, we're going to remake nukes. I'm pretty happy with the nuke situation here. Is this all mined out yet? Somehow this is not all mined out. 
Prepare the academy. Those kids need to learn, all right? Okay, perfect. And then we make... Factories over here. Yeah, see, we've got to be pretty close to the Zerg. I, th I mean, it seems like the fist is is completely cleared out, unless there's something hidden, and there may, may very well be. I, I will not hesitate to use the vision sheet, as usual. Orgas seem to have done a pretty good job at revealing where on the map things would be, which is quite nice. Let's just go ahead and set up turrets all around here, just in case. This is my staging area, which is why I need to set up some sort of defense around it to make sure we don't get flanked. Okay, and it looks... I was going to say, I see this is revealed, so there's one starport we're going to have to get rid of as well. Um... Okay, what's what's next, realistically? I think we just have to... Push down in this direction. Again, I don't remember... I don't know if we can realistically get to the Zerg or not. We're going to find out. Okay, starports. 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 Get out of the way, other SCV. Right there, it doesn't even matter where it is. I think we might be able to... I think we might be able to do it by pushing down in this direction. I'm not 100% certain. Ah, now see, there's another bridge here. I don't think this was here. Oh, fuck that. <laughs> okay, Ghost, why don't you just come and nuke the minefield? Nuke the minefield, friend. Do we want to go for the Zerg first or the Hammer first? I think we go for the Zerg first. Anybody it makes the most sense. Let's the names downtown. Again, I don't want to get tra I don't want to get caught out by these mines. A lot of these are badly damaged. Stop plaguing me, please. Let's set up turrets as well. And I'm making more starports than normal only because a lot of them will be used. Yeah, see, the Zerg are down here. Lots of broodlings. That should be expected at this point. Okay, and then I think we're... I mean, we want to nuke the Zerg as well, so why not just load up on nukes? Your forces are under attack. Add-on complete. Add-on complete. Okay. It is time. We are going to start pushing to the very bottom left. Battle cruisers, be the vanguard. Getting ensnared is fine. <laughs> I like this mixed group that I've got going on. It, it is useful. Let's grab you in another barracks. Grab another starport. Another barracks. I mean, we can afford to produce off of all of this, so why not? Here's another starport. We also have to go and destroy this. I could probably just Yamato it. Now, fortunately, here comes the hammer. That's pretty bad timing for me. Okay, and just nuke right there. I don't think I can be seen. Good day, Commander. And then nuke over there. Say, do nukes instantly kill colonies? Okay, so you can kind of tell what we're dealing with the, with at this point. So what we're going to want to do is basically rally down to where these battle cruisers are and build a boatload more of them. So rally here. I have to painstakingly change all of my rally points now. Here. 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 This is what I get for trying to have a little extra fun, which is like, hey, build actual... Uh, other units instead of mass battle cruiser. Oh wait, no, fuck you. This map is terrible. 
Uh, forces are under attack. It's, it, I mean, I'm not over-exaggerating. This map is just simply not fun. And I honestly don't know what Vorgas could have... Oh, my God. I honestly don't even know what Vorgas could have done to make it fun. It's just awful. It is truly awful. Okay, so... Jack Frost, you're up, buddy. My heroes can easily kill all these Hydralisks. We gotta clear all this out to allow my other units to get down there to the front. It's <laughs> the front. Like candy from a baby. Never know what it's it like taking candy I'm from a baby. Somebody call Snook for there. Need a light. I was say he can't see me, right? There we go. We got a lot of Goliaths coming. Battle cruisers, battle cruisers, battle cruisers, battle cruisers. Just queue up a lot of them. We'll, we'll use them, as we've learned. This is just throw your units away. The mission, basically playing Zerg with Terran. Oh my God. doesn't have enough for anybody else. Um, yeah, the only way to get rid of this stuff effectively, I think, is to nuke it. I'm going to wait until we have a pretty reasonably sized force back up. I'm going to take these two battle cruisers and Yamato this uh, this starport. The fist should be officially done after that. So one of three enemies are gone. We're on the way to get rid of the next one. Actually, the fist does have a thing in the bottom right, whatever whatever that really is. Why don't you Yamato this? You can Yamato this. Marines. And then lots of fire bats for fun. We're committed to this... We're committed to this fun approach. Quote, unquote, fun. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's bad. This is bad. Okay, so Yamato here. A lot of these battle cruisers, because they were plagued, are getting completely screwed. Okay, cool. Let's cancel these and make more science vessels. Do have a lot of Goliaths. I guess I can get some tanks, even though I don't... Oh, okay, and we're maxed. That's... I, I have been building things pretty quick. I'm pretty proud of that. Okay, so... Let's keep our heroes back a little bit while we decide what we're going to do. Hey, yeah, that's smart. We don't have to destroy this stuff, and I'm pretty certain that add-ons don't count. It looks like we did properly nuke this. Actually, decloak here. I'm going to wait for him to get some energy back, and maybe we can move up and, cl and uh, nuke the next area. The only thing to do now is just auto-attack our way down to the rest of the Zerg base. A lot of these battle cruisers are just going to get very quickly smoked. Okay, follow. Probably nuke with these. We got more units coming on in. And we're maxed out. It's just where are the majority of my... I mean, I have a lot of money that's sunk into units that uh, are really, really low HP. So it's kind of wasted. Lots of Hydralisks down here. It is tempting to uh, to bring my heroes and see what they can do. There's infested Terrans. That's horrifying. All, all my fire bats are gonna die to that. But they killed mo they killed themselves for the most part, actually. Your forces are under attack. Yep. Well, that again, that was expected. We watched a lot of our stuff get killed. Yes, sir. Can't kill here. You? Just picking this stuff off. We I, I don't know if we have to eliminate all the... I mean, I think the objective said eliminate all the Zerg. I assume that that's still been updated where we don't actually have to kill literally everything, but I, I don't know. Okay, so you guys back up, and now we rebuild everything. Marines and Marines and Fire Bats and Medics and Ghosts and then Goliaths. Goliaths. Battle Cruisers on their way down. Transmit orders. Transmit orders. Okay. I, I just... I don't think there's necessarily a great way to do this. I think we just have to... Well, we can just keep nuking. We could double nuke. Nukes have been great this map. I will say. I mean, for the size of the map, like, why not just nuke? A boatload. It is. It is working. All right. You have some. You have some good-looking energy, so we can move in with you and nuke. Why don't you nuke here? Okay. All right. And with that, we're gonna move in. 
These are just circlings. You all just give us vision. It's gonna be a big one. Nice. Okay, so here's my main force that's been reinforced. Yeesh. Okay. New dressed and elite guards. Why don't you back up? Charlie Vane and Jack Frost are fine. Why don't we just bring an SCV up? We'll repair our new dressed and elite guards again. I'm working hard to keep those alive. I think I'm doing fine. Repair, 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 repair. It's gonna be a big one. It's gonna be a big one. So there's like a couple things up here. We can pick that off with random units that we have rallied up. Your force is on your Nuke it again. Nuclear launch detected. No, we're, we're maxed out. We can't even make more nukes. This is our last nuke right here. Now, here's the important thing. There's a, there's a ground path to all these bases. It's just extremely arduous. Oh, my God. Uh, let's see if we can get Charlie, like, all the way back up here. Because otherwise, this base is done. I do have a lot of uh, missile turrets set up. So, hopefully... I don't know. I doubt we're really going to be able to to get down here in time to save this. Right. Charlie Vane and Jack Frost are fine. New Dresden Elite Guard is getting repaired. I'm going to try to get Charlie home to save us. We have to, like, skirt our way through the giant line of missile turrets, which I think we can do. It's going to be a big one. Yes, sir. It is going to be a big one. I think he can take these two. I mean, they're just going to scan and kill. Uh, they're just going to scan him anyway, so I think we just got to try to use him effectively here. Okay, and that should be most, if not all, of the Zerg. Somehow we're just, we're maxed out. Oh, it's these, it's this group of battle cruisers. All right, attack down in this direction. Receiving transmission. Ready to Charlie Dane saves the day. Repair, repair. Bane, ready to rock and I guess roll. we could just leave him here. I'm not really sure what else uh, what else he's contributing. Okay, are the Zerg done? They, they're mostly done, I'd say. We can stim and we can defense matrix him. Battle cruisers here. Ugh. <sighs> Okay. Okay. Can this be over, please? Please! So done with this. I, I should save just in case something happens to my heroes. Jack's looking good. No problem. Okay. And then all of you are gonna move up. Okay, actually, I gotta check if there's even anything left of the Zerg that we need to destroy. Yeah, see, this is these are all just colonies. I could roll the dice and assume we don't have to destroy this, and then we move in towards the... Uh, we move in towards the Fist next, which is down through here. And I think that is what we're gonna do. I don't need to destroy all this. It looks like th this might actually be connected down here. Yeah, see, this is all this is all changed. This was not here in the original. Again, the Zerg were, I think, almost exclusive. I think the Zerg might have been on an island. They might have been connected to the Fist, but it definitely wasn't connected to anything else. So now we have to try to get all these units back here. We're going we're gonna to re-rally over here because we're going to start pushing down through this direction. Yeah, okay. So let's start backing up. Your forces are under We're gonna get caught out by a few things here or there. Okay, most important thing though is that we're looking good. Set up groups of turrets over here. Charlie should be able to skirt right by all this all these defenses. Jack Frost is fine. I am going to set up more nukes because, the, honestly, it's it's been very effective. Uh, we know that the hammer is still... The, the hammer is our main threat at this point, but the... Um, what else is there? What else is there? The, um, the fist still has one... 
one base down here. So again, now it's just clean up. It looks like the Zerga revealed, indicating to us that our that we've done it. We've uh, we've cleared out our enemy almost completely. I'm not sure if that's saying like here's all here's where all the enemy is, so you can go and kill them. Oops, just hit my microphone. Here's where all the enemy is, so you can easily go and kill them. Or it's saying. Um, don't bother anymore because you've destroyed them. That would be the ideal situation. I don't know if that's the case. Orders received. Affirmative. Roger that. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Uh, but the hammer, or the, I'm sorry, the fist didn't get revealed, so that's that's kind of harrowing to me. Um, I want to say there's like another big line of mi missile turrets up here. We might want to get rid of those so that we can reinforce easily along the way. Not enough energy. We all die, Frost. I'll be waiting for you. This might be a situation where we don't want to risk our heroes because we're so close to the end. This down here is weird, too. I wonder if I could just use Charlie Vane and go and pick that off. The name's Vane. Like, just exclusively Charlie Vane. I bet I bet he could do it. Okay, so we're going to start moving down here, and we're going to rally over there. Receiving headquarters. We're going to rally down, like to this area. Yeah, like right here. So we're going to change all these rally points and then start slamming out units again. Trying to just click all these and then click the click the mini-map. This is extremely arduous. This is a problem with StarCraft 1 because it's an old game, not because the map is bad, but wait, the map is bad because they knew what they were working with and they still made it terrible. Um, I don't know if I even have suggestions for Vorgaz. I don't know what you could honestly do to make this any better. It's just bad. It's just a bad map. Okay, and then move up with everything and then start making, well, fire bats for fun, more ghosts and medics for lockdown related purposes, goliaths, battle cruiser, battle cruiser, battle cruiser, battle cruiser. New Dresden Elite Guard have really got their shit together if they can build this many battle cruisers in one mission. Let me tell you, they, uh. They've got a pretty solid situation. Get out of here! Oh my god. <laughs> okay, go, please. Just go and start getting rid of this. We'll take our battle cruisers and swing down and get rid of the rest of the fist here pretty soon. Okay, and now. Hello? Anybody the real push home? begins. We move up with our SCVs and maybe even make stuff up here. We nuked this a bunch of times. Doesn't seem like it had a particularly great effect, but whatever. Get rid of that. Lockdowns are happening. Here comes Charlie. I don't even know where Tsunami is. Get rid of all their spellcasters, though. There we go. Okay, I'm moving up with my heroes, too. Gotta be on the lookout for spider mines. We'll lose those new dress and elite guards real quick if we're not careful with that. Marines, Marines, fire bats, ghosts, goliaths. Okay, and then everything else will slowly make its way up. Can we, please? See, like, where, where, where did this come from? <laughs> we'll never know. Your forces are under attack. Okay, move on up. Things downtown. Do I not have science vessels? That's a big problem. They must have died. Crap. Um, Fist of Redemption is next. They're right here, so let's get rid of them. Then we gotta figure out... I mean, the hammer base is very close. We found their giant wall of missile turrets, which again means that we're close. What we can do in the meantime is just make turrets. Do I have nukes stocked up? I do, okay. I seem to have found something extreme. Oh my god. This this could be a true dream. Please, please, please. Is he do I have a do I have a ghost somewhere that's channeling that? Because I don't think I do. Uh Okay, clearly there's a there's an AI issue if those things are all stuck there, but whatever. Um, got a nice sized army that's up here. 
one Marine. Get out of here. That's the other issue with large maps. You think you're starting to clean it up, and then it's just a nightmare. The name's Vane. My goodness. Let's kill one of these at least. Let's see if we can... If we can... Well... I was say, if we could just nuke this whole section, that would be cool, but I didn't think I don't think so. Okay, I think Fist is done. I think. They, they must be now. Oh, yeah, see, now they're all revealed. So, Fist is done. Now we just have to get to the last base. How do we get to the last base? I don't know. So, what we're going to have to do... We're grouped up again. Keep our heroes back. Let's scan a little bit. You know what I need are... Um, Science vessels. Very badly. Do we have any units that are just hanging out? Ah, okay. Actually, we found him. We found him. Um, how do we get up there? How? how <laughs> I think we have to go all the way around. That doesn't surprise me. Yeah, there's no ramp here. I think we have to come all... Yeah. Oh. Everything that's wrong with StarCraft is, is, is like somehow all wrapped neatly into this one map, and it's just it's just a nightmare. This whole map is a goddamn nightmare. I hate everything. I hate it. I hate it. Uh, so yeah, we gotta figure out how to get in there. Gotta destroy all this stuff along the way and get up to his base, and the ramp is down here. Fucking stupid. Okay, so... Let's just grab some ground units and attack our way over there and see what path they take. Yep, that's what I expected. Go with the battle cruisers. All of you, lead the way. Battle cruisers, just just don't don't go out of a really strange way, please. We know that we can reinforce at least. That's the most important thing. Some things never change. Can we please? Thank you. Okay. Kill that stupid man. Now, of course, they didn't go neutral. Those turrets didn't go neutral. We have to... Hey, they didn't die. Okay, the battle cruisers again being our, our vanguard here. We have to clear out a lot of these turrets up here to get to this one stupid starport. Okay, everybody keep pushing down here. Some Heroes, I think it's your time change. to shine. Because we've cleared out any spider mines that may have been in this area. We have to destroy this. I don't know where Tsunami is. We'll, we'll get to him eventually. <sighs> Deep breaths. We're almost done with this. I should have split this. It's not worth it. Like, it's, 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 I should have split this. Um, if you've watched this whole thing, I'm proud of you. You've, you've watched my slow descent into madness. This is, this is just terrible. Oh, you got EMP'd. Of course you did. Okay. Attack. Heroes. Um, again, just be extra safe, please. Keep pushing. Fire it up indeed. Marines, Marines, fire bats, and ghosts. I, I like this goofy little mix that we've got going on here, but not that much because I really just wish this was over. Okay. Lots of, lots and lots of, uh, oh my god, if we can nuke Tsunami, that would be hilarious. I, I don't think we're going to be able to, but if we could. Actually, we might. You guys all stay back. Ah, they can see us. That sucked. Just one nuke needs to land for this to be great. Please, please, please. Yes, yes, yes. He's been nuked. Eat shit, Tsunami. That's so much supply that we just used right there for that. Nuke, nuke, and nuke. Let's show them. So, as you saw, look at all those spider mines that were in this base, just to be jerks. If, if, like, say we had Jack Frost up there, 
he'd be dead, and I would be real upset. <laughs> uh, on that note, because we're sending our heroes in, let's say, because we've made it this far, um, I don't know, is this, is this, you tell me, is this less boring than, uh, than if I would have just made mass battle cruisers? I don't know. It's, it's, it's truly hard to say. Heroes, heroes, you're up. Go and get him. Charlie Vane! Jack Frost with the killing blow! Anybody home? They've done it. Yes, sir. Uh, okay, battle cruisers, battle cruisers, battle cruisers. Hey, we're out of gas! Look at that! We've been playing this for so long, we ran out of gas. Uh, we just have, we have to find the rest of... Oh, oh be careful, Charlie Vane. Uh, we have to find the rest of their production structures, which may... I, I don't think armories count, but we'll destroy these anyway. We also can nuke. Cover Jack Frost. Throw a nuke, a fatty nuke up there. The name's Vane. The name's Vane. Get him. Get him, Charlie. Get him, Jack. Get out of this. Uh. Okay. I, I honestly think that that, that that one starport is the last one. Let's finish it up with a nuke. Though I don't know. There's a lot of stuff that's still left to be uncovered on this map. It could be, it could be anywhere. Destroy the science facility. If this is it, this this should end the mission. The hammer isn't revealed to us or anything. Let's watch it, please. Congratulations, you finished the Turan campaign. The scatter remains the rebels turn tail and ran. It won't be long before our troopers pick them up and deal with them. But hey, it ain't over till the fat lady sings. So buckle up, take a break, and get ready for some more action. What a terrible map. As you can see, we had to start in the upper right, go across like three bridges to get rid of the fist, all the way down to the zerg, and then all the way to the right to the hammer, and there was no path between all of them. I honestly think maybe you're just sort of meant to make mass battle cruisers, but again, the map is so big that it still takes forever to clear the map with them, and there's so many turrets that they're going to get whittled away anyway. It's just a nightmare. I think I did as good as I could. Um, I don't know. I, I'm not 100% sure what Vorgas has changed. I think he's made a few terrain changes, and I think this could stand to have a lot of terrain changes because it is god-awful. <laughs> I'm glad it's over. This, again, is possibly the worst map in the entirety of the game. Uh, of Insurrection, I should say. It's it's it's. I, I almost want to say it's easily the worst map, but hearing Jack Frost say the Terran campaign... Uh, at the end does make up for it, I suppose, a little bit. All right, thanks, everyone, for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye now.